time for us to learn a little bit about some environmental news around the area. Environmentally Sound is brought to you by Mason County Garbage, and I'm happy to have AmeriCorps Sustainability Coordinator working up at the Salmon Center. Back again, Kate McElroy. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I am well. How are you? Doing good. Good. Coming up on the end of your time with yeah. the Salmon Center and AmeriCorps here. Yep, yep. Got about a month left, yeah. Very nice. Well, it's a busy month and a great month here uh, in yes. the Northwest. Uh, July, the end of June and July with the solstice, I guess, is tomorrow. You guys have anything p- planned for the solstice? Ooh, I don't know. Not that I know of. Call Seth up yeah. and have a big party or something <laughs> up there. That'd be a lot of fun. Well, what's going on at the Salmon Center? So, uh, actually, we're prepping for the garden tour right now. Okay. So, the Master Gardeners have a garden tour that they do annually and this year we get to be a part of it and we're really excited about that and really honored um, so we've been prepping for that and we've also been working on getting our you pick ready for people to come and and pick their own vegetables and things like that so what's sprouting anything good that's yeah sprouting? so right now we have a lot uh, we have a lot of strawberries we have um, a lot of snap peas uh-huh. and um, later on as things start to grow we'll have tomatoes and basil and greens and cu- kind of stuff like that yeah so got a lot of stuff going all right let's talk about the garden tour here the uh, master gardeners foundation of mason county puts on once again the 2017 garden tour it's coming up july 8th from 10 to 4 uh in between allen and belfair there are some beautiful homes with some wonderful gardens that they are so kind to open up their areas for folks to Trape. I mean, they're not. You're not traipsing around. <laughs> but you're, you know, you're in in their area. Yeah, checking exactly. Out the garden. So, exactly. Uh, we need to get tickets for this thing. Let's start yes. with that. Where are tickets yeah. and what's the cost? Yeah, so um, the tickets are $12, okay. um, and you can purchase them at a couple of locations um, around Allen and Belfair in the general area. So um, you can buy in Shelton at Brilliant Moon on Railroad and Lynch Creek Floral, which is also on Railroad. Mm-hmm. Um, and then in Olympia, you can buy it at Blue Heron Bakery. Sure. Um, in Allen, you can buy it at Windermere Peninsula Properties, um, which is just on the three. Um, and then in Belfair, you can do the Buck Shop on Route 3. Uh, or in Port Orchard, you can do the Brothers Greenhouses, which is on Victory Drive. Okay, very nice. And again, about seven beautiful gardens. Yes. A ticket booklet includes maps to these. And uh, for more information on the tour info, you can head to the Extensions office there. And uh, mm-hmm. they have got it all over the place. So is uh, the Salmon Center going to be one of these spots where folks can yeah. come by? Yeah, so the Salmon Center is going to be one um, station on the garden tour. Um, So, yeah, so people will kind of come through and see what we've got to have, um, you know, demonstration gardens and also, like, active, you know, um, picking availability and you pick going on at that same time. Um, We have a high tunnel and the front garden that we're uh, we're really prepping. We have a native plant garden. Um, So, yeah, we're really excited to show off our space. What's the uh, time schedule for the you pick who when when yeah, can people yeah. come there so um so right now we've got a couple of things we've got strawberries and peas coming up right now and then um kind of as we move into the warmer months we're going to have more coming up so probably you know within a month we should be kind of in peak peak season yeah and uh eight o'clock is when mm-hmm. that's yeah open. so the salmon center is open from like eight to five on weekdays um so yeah you can just kind of come in and browse around and then um leave a donation with us in oh, lieu okay. of payment um and so that can be done in the kitchen just come into the office it's pretty relaxed this week and last week and maybe well for some kids maybe even next week starting to wrap up school yeah But uh, a lot of kids come by the Salmon Center Mm -hmm. during the summer, right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So we have uh, we have camps, actually, that we host at the Salmon Center. So uh, we have Enviro Camp coming up and then we also have some field trips coming up and things like that. Yeah. So we've got a lot of a lot of activities for kids to do in the summer, too. Well, Kate, it's been really nice talking with you uh, over the time here as you've been in town and getting ready to head back to Kentucky. Yes. And that'll be a quite a uh, shift, I'd imagine. Yeah, absolutely. So you'll be there in August? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yep, 100 well, degrees. You, thinking back to the old uh, cool conditions yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, right near, near the waters of uh, the Salmon Center. You can find out more information at the Hood Canal Salmon Enhancement Group. I'll find them online. We'll put links to all this as well. Well, Kate, thanks for letting us know. Again, July 8th is the 2017 Garden yes. Tour. Seven beautiful gardens, including the garden at the Salmon Center. Have a great day. You too. Thank you so much.